Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of my 7 Days to Die series Surviving Alpha 18. Looks like I'm going to have to survive this. I was in a mine here, getting stone all night, and I uh, hit up some uh, um, lead here, and these guys heard me. I think it was a watering board. That's it. I think it was just the three of them. Let's get another door made here. Uh, yeah, as you can see, I got a ton of resources. Even found some diamond and gold and stuff. Which is just a random skill that I have. Oops. There's a screamer out there. Wonderful. I burned through three three repair kits, and now this is my fourth bacon and eggs. I went through a half a stack of uh, red tea, but as you can see, we got what one, two, three, four, five stacks of stone, two and a bit stacks of iron, uh, a few pieces of metal, and some lead here. So I hit up this uh, lead deposit as I was working my way along. And as I got down here, we hit up another one right at the end here. Now on the map, if we look, this is where my mine was here. Kind of dug down this way and then straight up this way. I was kind of hoping to make it to this building, but didn't quite get there. But we got a lot of stone. I'm going to hit up a little bit more stone before we get out of here. Um, just going to move along this way. And then in the morning we'll go up, see what's who's up there. Um, kill them and I think we'll make our way home get off to the traders now I did get a bit of uh, um, a little bit of work done at the house I put seven more um, farming nodes down so I was just listening for zombies there because we did have a couple of things we had some uh, blueberries uh, some coffee another um, golden rod seed we put those down got a couple of trees planted now there as well at the house uh, so I didn't do too much, but I did get uh, what stone we had moving um, and as much concrete as I could get going, going. Um, I picked up a whole ton of sand too uh, in the desert, so I got like 5,000 sand. Uh, at least we can get some concrete moving when we get back. Hopefully we'll have a bunch of... Uh, ready to, well not ready, necessarily ready to go. I'm gonna have to get a, probably a second forge going with just stone in it uh, To get the amount of concrete we're gonna need. I'd rather have uh, it done earlier rather than later I'll Grab a bit more of this while we're here Gives us some stone and some sand now, I did spend some skill points before we go above ground here. I did spend some skill points, so let's have a look at that. I did have, I think it was five or six at the end of the last episode. Um, so what I did is um, I put one into yay science, so we had the scholar done here. Uh, I put another one into turrets, I believe, only because the, this gives us the ability for our turret to fire a little faster and do a little bit more damage, which is going to be great. Um, and it also increases the range from 10 to 14 meters, so it gives us a bit more range in our junk turrets. Uh, so I did that. Then I added a point into Machine Gunner because we're going to need this extra uh, increased fire rate and uh, faster reload and a little bit more damage for Horde Knight. Um, and then I did uh, two into Strength, and I did Minor 69 or a Mother Load, one point in each. Um, We've got the extra point now because of the uh, cigar that we have. So I'll be able to add another point into these guys when we get some more for mining. And I think that was it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that was all we did. So that looks pretty good. Let's go above ground. Yeah, got some guys right here. Come on, buddy. I can't waste my time. Die. What are they hitting out there? 
Yo, jerk. Ooh, thank you. Eh. Alright, let's get out of here. Come on. There we go. Oh, they're over there. Never mind. Let's get out of here. Let me go back to the house. So there's the house there. It's starting to look pretty good. I mean, it's it's getting there. The ground is never really that great, but, you know, it's just going to be concrete down here. But up there, it'll look pretty nice when we're done, I think. All right, let's get in and drop this stuff off. Okay, now I filled that in a little bit. Uh, they all needed to have extra wood put on them, so I did that. Now we have some concrete. Yeah, I got a little bit of mix going here overnight. So we got a bit of concrete now. Eh, wrong one. Here we go. Okay, now we don't have room for any of that stuff in there. Let's just put some over here. I'm gonna do that. Actually, let's take two of these out. Oh, that's all our parts. Do we have any parts in here? A little bit. Let's drop them in there. Um, so let's get two of these going. Uh, we'll need probably that much at least. And let's get as much of this going as we can. Get some more mix going. And we're going to be out of here for the day, I think, because I don't want to get uh, zombies or uh, screamers on our ass here. So we're going to go and sell some stuff. Now I'm going to keep the diamond because this can be used uh, to make diamond blade tips. Don't know how many we need for this. For the, if we can find Art of Mining Volume 2, that would be great. So I'm going to hang on to the diamonds. Uh, that can go in there. Actually, we can put uh, these guys in here now. Let's put one and then let's get this going. Um, do that. Yeah, man, we're going to have screamers here when we come back today. For sure. Um, let's just drop these in here for now. Okay. You these guys back on so we don't forget you, you and you. Uh, clay can go in there. Sand can go in there. Dirty glasses go up here. And we're going to be selling these today. So let's take some stuff to sell. Uh, we're going to sell the one hammer. We're definitely going to sell that. I'm going to sell the spear. Uh, we've got a lot of junk hurts now. I think I'll be scrapping these guys for parts. We'll keep the rest. Uh, I'm going to sell... How much is this worth? Yeah, I'm going to sell that AK. want to keep that. Um, I want to sell the wooden boat. No, I think we'll hang on to it. This is a backup. You never know, right? Uh, these knuckles we're going to sell. Yeah, we're really woefully low on ammo, so we've got to, have to be, be uh, very conscious of that. The second set of nerdy goggles we can sell or nerdy glasses, um, dress shoes, stun baton, I don't know if we'll ever make one, but we'll hang on to it for now. And I think that's it for sales, how much is this worth, nine? Better off just melting it, I guess. Okay, let's go hit up the trader. All right, here we go. Let's see what Jen's got for us today. Hopefully it's something good. Now we're definitely, we're woefully low on eggs, so hopefully she's got some eggs. Uh, what do you got for inventory here? So let's sell the stuff. All right, that gives us 6,700. Now let's have a look here. Uh, we've got lock picks. Um, forged steel, mechanical parts, feathers, bow, crossbow parts, gunpowder, 
Gonna buy the powder. Yeah, nothing we need there. Oh wow, this is really bad here. Storage pocket mod. Let's buy that. The less encumbered we are, the better. Oh, baseball bat, but it's only level one. Twenty six fifty two. What's our uh, 2441. Well, it is better. For 504. Uh, let's go that route. Who knows? We might find a better one in the future, but we'll go that route for now. Uh, two jars of honey. No. Oh, 22 eggs. Yes, please. Yes, please. Let's go chassis 4x4 four four truck schematic. Night Stalker Volume 7. Sneak damage to sleeping victims at night. Yeah. Chances of us needing that early on is not going to be good. Or we definitely probably won't need that. Um, a truck chassis though. We'll be specking into that eventually, so I'm not really worried about that. So I think that's probably it. There was no um, no bullet tips or anything like that. AP762 ammo. How much is that going to cost us? 1500 Um, Oh. Going to buy the rocket ammo. Because I want to get a rocket launcher going too if I can. Um... I know this is better ammo because it'll go straight through a whole bunch of... Uh, you know what? Let's do it. I gotta really start thinking about Horde Knight now. And there's no ammo here, right? Right. Okay, so... Be with you, my friend. And you. Uh, you got any jobs? Fetch clear north. I have a task for you, How's friend, Old Victorian? Perfect. You're interested. Godspeed. Let's go do that. So I'm going to work on getting that motorcycle built. We do have the skill now. I believe we got the skill to make the motorcycle. Did we not? We got that, right? Yeah, we do. We just have to have our lucky... Uh, gotta have our uh, um, nerdy goggles on to be able to do it we can build a motorbike now and I'm gonna do that I'm gonna get the parts I think we've got everything we need oh you know what I used the engine for, we're gonna need to wrench an engine today that's the other thing we need we've got a battery I have to wrench and get an engine today I can't believe we found 22 eggs at the trader oh go away I heard that bird flapping its wings back there. We've got to raid this passive gas too at some point. Where is this house? Is it this one? No, it'll have to be past this one, I think. That bird's still following us. Oh, we need the feathers, so... I'll let him, ta I'll let, let him trail along. Uh, it's this guy right here, right? Yeah. Where are you? There you are. Oh, come on, bring it in. Bring it in. What do you think the chances are we can hit him with this guy? Nope. One more shot, and then we'll go inside. Yeah, let's go in. Bet you he attacks me now, though. Do that, do that, that shadow. Now nah, he's just going to swoop around. All right, let's get our pocket in. Where can we drop that? That's got two already. Got a helmet light in that. Two in there. Two in there. We can't really fit it in anywhere unless we take something out. Let's take this and we'll modify this. And we're going to just pull out this for now. Okay, put that on. And then 
Reinforced club, we just got a structural brace on it, so modify this, take that out. And we'll modify this, that in. Marginally better damage, but not very good durability, but who, you know, who cares. All right. Yeah, look at this thing. It's already got blood on it. Nice. Uh, do we want to check in here first? What do we got? No cars? No cars. All right, let's take this tree down because I don't want it here when I come back out. I can't stand when there's like trees and I can't see beyond them. Boom. All right. Not that we need that now, but what's this? Yeah, okay. Put the egg back in here. And let's get that one crossbow bolt made. Nice, okay. Let's do this. This should be an interesting one. Okay, so our supplies on this floor. Hey, it's Mo. Who else is it going to be? It's a Mo corn. That's a good look for you, Mo. Okay, let's just grab stuff as we, as we go here. Ah, uh, needs repairs, really? Let's just scrap this. All right. Anybody up here? Nothing up there. All right. Loot as we go. Yeah, a little bit of stuff. Nothing up there. What do we got in here? Oh, yeah. Okay, rocket launcher parts, magazine extender. Do we have a magazine extender already in here? We do. Okay. Well, that's going to be good for the AK. No dogs. No dogs. Every time I see a doghouse, every dog looks like we're going in the basement. Hooray. All right. We can do this. We head up, stick on the ice, don't get beat. Oh, I know what. You know, this, I've been in this place before. There's uh Yeah, we can wrench these things here. That the weight system, the weight will give us steel. Now I don't know if I can shoot through this. Did I hit him? Oh stop being a wiggly woggly. Ice hole. Grab our important stuff. Popping pills. What do you think the chance of finding a beaker is? Pretty good. Nice. Whoever this person was, definitely were a roid head here. At least it looks that way. So use that bandage. Okay, we're going to wrench this sucker. Now, I think this is the only one down here that will give us uh, um, forged steel. We're going to need to make a crap ton of steel. We really need a crucible. Come on, it's all forged iron. Was that all just iron? It was. I thought for sure that would give us steel. Well, can't have everything. Take that because I got a feeling I'm going to need it. Okay, we got water. I got to stop picking stuff up.
Well, we, we, we will replenish the bandage that we lost. I love this baseball bat. I want to get a spike mod for it, though. Okay, where is that? Probably next room. Let's not look in here yet. The dog kennel. There better not be a dog here. There's a snake. And a soldier zombie. Alright, well... There's the snake. Ladder up. Oh, juicy. All right, let's get the snake. Not going to give us much, but we'll take it. Yeah, 10 meat. That was weird seeing a snake in there. I think that's the first snake I've seen in the house. Sewing so kits, definitely gonna need that. Uh, yeah, I'll just take it for now. All right, what do we got here? Ooh, a little bit of raviolis, just use that. Bit of Chef Boy RD. What do we got here? Yeah. Soda found. Oh, there's a uh, gun safe back there. And a backpack. It's kind of a weird uh, setup back here. Yeah, man. Free stone. Two hits for 80 stone. I'll take it. Oh. Until all that shit falls on you. All right, scrap this. And there's our satchel. That's nice. Probably would have gone right by that. All right, uh, let's, let's see if we can pick this sucker here. We've been getting pretty good with this with the uh, log picking. So, come on, first shot. I'll take the first shot, please. Saving our picks. Oh, so close, yet yeah, so far. Alright, now the thing I find about these safes is you can keep burning your lock picks all you want. But I find if you go away for a second, let's just do this. Let's use this and do a couple of things. And I I I, I don't okay. I don't know if this is actually a thing or not. If you go away and come back, I think the the random number gen gets reset, and you get a better chance to complete the pick. Eh, I could be wrong. Could be completely wrong. Oh, apparently wrenching gun saves will get you lots of metal too. Oh, there's our uh, airdrop. All right, we're gonna have to come back. Let's go finish this house up. And then we'll come back down and probably wrench that safe. So much paper. Some beers. Shh. Nobody sleeping in the kitchen? Nobody in the kitchen? Uh, I bet you I know where some people are, though. Good thing I didn't get into combat with that. What the hell, dude. Gotta re learn to reload. You don't look so good. You don't look good at all. Get these out of our way in case we need to make a break for it. Scrap these up. Yeah, see ya. So I do find in this build that the uh, having one of each of the different types of goggles 
is kind of a good idea. It lets you do and build things that you normally wouldn't be able to do. So for instance, sneak damage, we're doing two and a half times. I can get the goggles and rather that rather than spending a couple of points to raise a skill up, I can just use the goggles, get the skill raised up, buy the next level of Ooh. Reloaded? Yep. Okay, good. Come on, Mo. Bring it down. Bring it down so we can rumble. Ooh, took that one right in the noggin. See ya. A little bit of a love tap for Mo. There you go. Yeah, so you can, like, raise the skill up the extra point you need buy the point in the other skill that, that's skill dependent, right? Make whatever you need or, or do whatever you need with it and then take the goggles off. And then if you're like in the house going to kill shiz, you can wear your uh, goggles and get your... Uh, okay, I'm going to take these. Disease resist 100%. I don't want to get any disease here. And let's just go with one of these. And, yeah, we've got enough food in this, so we're probably fine. What's this challenge? Kill the Wabbit challenge. Let's just get it in our inventory. Don't know if we'll ever do it, but we'll, we'll have it on us. One, in uh, one of the games I'm playing on the side, it's like, I've got, I don't know how many of those challenges now. Like four or five of them. No zombies in here. Sure. I don't know why I'm still looting this garbage. Ammo? <laughs> Nothing. Really? Probably because these are going to be good, right? Okay. Lucky looter. Find more money just laying around. I'll use that. That's good. Ooh. Marksman rifle schematic. Yeah, we've already got that one. All right. Alrighty. I'm loving this crossbow, I gotta say. Compound crossbow for the wind. Let's make some noise. Looks like we're going to an attic as well. Take that. Take this. Yeah, she just seemed a little too happy. <laughs> I had no idea this thing was behind here. <laughs> uh, I got lucky. wonder if we'll have time to wrench that safe in the basement. Come on. Big box, no whammies. Oh, yeah. Ah, okay, we'll take it. Can't say no to that. I'm starting to get a little slow here, though. Watch out for the mines. Oh, we'll use that. What's this? Eight bucks in a sewing kit. Wonder if that's the product of the uh, the book we just got. All right. No zombies. Okay, room clear. Uh, okay. We're going in maximum overload here. Stay quiet. Okay, that's a positive sign. Let's grab this stuff. And maybe wake up the zombies next door. If there is any, that is. Well, there has to be, because we haven't cleared all the areas yet. Bet you there's a shit ton behind that furnace. I'm not taking a chance.
Yeah. It's Big Mama. Freaker Boy. And a crawler, really. Ah, uh, let's get downstairs. Come on, you guys. Oh, he took that one right into pills. He's one, he's one, he wants a pill shot too. Look at this guy. Oh! <laughs> How did you like that, buddy? Oh. The physics in this game. So brilliant. Okay, let's get this cobble. I'm not going to be using too much more cobble other than on the regular part of the house. Knock, knock. It's a football player. Let me guess, he's the guy with the roids. He's the guy... He's the guy that owns everything in the basement. All right, let's grab this. All right, let's do this first before we do uh, do anything here. We're going to uh, scrap all the paint. I know it seems ridiculous, but... Uh, let's drop this. Um, so, scrap these. So paint is like oil now. Um, so I don't want to like spend oil if I don't have to, to get paint. Uh, scrap. We're probably not going to be keeping any of that stuff. Uh, let's scrap this. Um, what else? I'll probably ditch the cans. All right, so let's just take the weapon bag stuff. Start with that. Oh my god! Level 6 knife. Okay, we can scrap these. Take the 6 knife. That can go up over here. Oh, we can scrap this. Uh, we really don't need that. Oh, we do need that. <laughs> we, need, we need one more is what we need. We don't need the cloth fragments. The level 100 knife we'll just scrap. Let's take that and that. We'll scrap this. I hate scrapping stuff, but we're going to do it. Oh, okay, well, that's good. They're both good, actually. Uh, ammo. Okay, more more good stuff. And let's see what we got in here. One electrical part. All right, Shotgun Messiah. Shamway. Let's do Shamway first. Okay. Uh, don't need the electrical part. We've already got those. Meat stew. I should really just save this, but look at that. Alright, shotgun aside. Good stuff. Oh. We can take the repair kits. Iron arrows. Let's just scrap those. All right. What do we got in here we want to take? Scrap polymers, electrical parts. It's easy to find scrap polymers, I think. Don't need that. All right. Well, I guess we're not wrenching that safe in the basement. Well, we will give it another shot before we leave. It is close to the bike. So, um, we still got lots of time, too. Well, half decent amount of time, anyway. Let's get down to that basement. Anything behind here? Oh, yep. Uh, and it's nothing. Okay, one more shot at this. All right, we're wrenching this. Um, let's take some stuff to the bike first. 
Okay, so we got some good things we can put in here. Let's put these muffled connectors because we're definitely going to keep those. Uh, selling most of this other stuff. The AK will probably sell. Extended clip modifier we're going to keep. Okay, so we got three slots left. I don't think there's anything else that we can stack in there. Is there no ammo, gunpowder? No, that's fine. So let's go back in. All right, I wonder how long this is going to take. What? I thought you could wrench this. I guess not. All right, there we go. You know what it is? Oh, nice. Uh, I was being a bit of a moron there. So in order to wrench this, let's do that. Let's do that. Let's take a U for sale. Uh, what can we get rid of? We don't really need the beer. Take that. Um, the bones. Ditch the bones, maybe. The piece of glass. Uh, we need that for the window. Ditch the bones. Okay, I think it's now that it's been picked. Yeah, there we go. So we can wrench it after that. So we need a slot here. Just use the bandage. I don't know why I'm quibbling over this damn thing. Just use the damn bandage. If we can get steel out of this. There's iron. And there we go. So we picked up, what? About 10 forged iron and 6 forged steel. So that is pretty good. That's just the junk. Mechanical parts we don't need. Oh, springs. Well, you know what? We don't need any of that stuff right now. Let's just get out of here. Now, I don't know if we'll have time to go to the trader. We got four hours. Well, probably. We got a ton of stuff we got to get rid of. So let's go to the trader. Hope that bird is gone. All right, here we go. Let's get to let's get to the trader, and then uh, we might be able to pick up the airdrop on the way back. Wait, where is the airdrop? Oh, it's over that way. So that's another day. I'll put a marker on it once we get to the trader. Yeah, so apparently these street lights up here, apparently they've got steel as well. So if we don't get a crucible, at least we'll be able to get some steel. Now I was thinking about using the steel to make... Uh, look at this. That's awesome. Look how many, look how many nodes are here. That's going to be a big mine, I think, right there. Um... I was thinking about using the steel to make mods with, but I think what we're going to do is we're going to hang on to it. Uh, and worst case scenario, whatever steel we do have, um, like we have to make we have to make doors. So uh, maybe I should just start buying steel from the trader. I'm just really banking on getting a crucible because we really need that really badly. Okay, not too bad. It only took us 45 minutes to get here. Yeah, let's see what you got here. Now we're cooking with Wow, gas. really? What's that worth? 264. Uh, 176, 105. Although the exploding crossbow bolts? 250 explosion damage might be worth it no we're gonna be like you know what though once they're all bunched up that might actually work let's go with the exploding crossbow bolts Ooh, okay shamway secret recipe huh fortifying grip mod flaming crossbow bolt ammo 261, 176, 64. What do we have on here? Oh, we got the brace already. Uh, we got to get rid of something first. So let's do um, this. Get rid of this stuff. Uh, yeah. All right, I sold a couple things that I probably shouldn't have because we could have scrapped them for parts, but that's fine. So he's got, back now. they've got forged well, steel too, eh? Traveler, so let's take the well, fortifying grip mod. That's pretty good for melee. Um, 
inventory. Oh, we want to sell this too. Nice. So let's buy how much? 71 forged steel for that, eh? You know what? If I buy if I do this now, if I buy this, you know what's gonna happen? Everyone knows what's going to happen. I'm going to find a, either a crucible recipe or I'll, or I'll get a crucible from the trader and not be able to pay for it. <sighs> Got to make a decision. Let's just get 10. That'll give us 20. Gratitude. Oh, actually, you know what? Let's get four more. Brand. Four more. Because uh, this will be enough for me to make it's two doors with. Real pleasure. You want yeah, we can make two there. doors that way. All right, let's head back. All right, so uh, going to do this real quick. And then, where? How far north is that? Oh, that's a good distance. All right, let's go. What are we stuck on? Oh, a piece of wood. Really? All right, we needed to wrench a car for an engine too. We never did that today. Is there anything around? Really quick. I have to fight zombies probably in there. There's one out in front of the passing gas here. Let's grab this one. Now, is it complete enough? It is. Okay, perfect. We might get an engine out of this one. We've already looted it. Beautiful. Come on, engine. There's a battery. Nope, no engine. Damn it. Well, I think we already had a battery. Another car over here. Still got an hour and a half. That's not going to give us what we want. Big bucks. No whammies. Headlight. We do need a light. I think we've already got a headlight though. Come on. No, engine? Really? Well, that was a dud. That was just garbage. Oh, brass radio. What am I missing? What did I got? Uh, okay, scrap this. Definitely want the brass radiator. Well, can't win them all. Now we do have a car outside our house, house over here. Uh, I don't have room to put anything in though, so let's... I don't think we got time. Well, we might be able to sneak out there and do it. Get a headlight on. All right, let's quickly go drop a couple things off. I should really put a drop chest down out here. Come on. Move it. Okay, uh, junk turret, arrows, you, 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 no, you don't go there. But we can put you in there for now. Uh, is that just a screamer I heard? Uh, I don't remember where I put the beakers. Okay, let's go see if we can get that car wrenched apart. Might just have enough time. Now is this... No, that's a whole hunk of wreck. Okay, big bucks, no whammies. Give me an engine. Nope.
Well, I guess we're not making a motorbike tonight, but I guess we can, you know what, though, we can get all the parts together, and as soon as we get the, uh, the engine, we can finish it up. Because I think that last stage of just the assembly doesn't take very long. And the motorbike, um, most of the important uh, parts are in the chassis and the uh, handlebars. So it's just a, those two, two tires, which we do have, or two wheels, uh, which we've already got. Um, and let's see here, let's drop this stuff in here. Okay, up here, we got you guys. Bicycle can go there now. And over here, rocket parts. We've only got two. I don't think we'll be able to build one, but that's fine. Um, let's get our window in. Very nice. All right. Uh, Okay, we got two beakers now, perfect. That was very fortuitous. Let's put you in here. Let's swap out. This is plus 90. But the fortifying grip's a little better because it gives us 50% uh, ag. When, when your health is below 50%, you gain one hit point every five seconds. So it's kind of like really important. So we'll do that. Structural bikes we'll put somewhere else for now. All right, so the motorcycle. Uh, right, I'm gonna need those for making stuff here. Um, gonna put together a little kitchen. Uh, so handlebars, we need duct tape, headlight, electrical parts, forged steel, we do need steel. How much do we need for the chassis? Oh, we don't have the chassis yet. Oh, yes we do. Cause, not wearing these. There we go. Uh, we need 30 forged steel. Got 38. What, would it, what do we need for the... Uh, sick, we got enough. Headlight, electrical, mechanical, leather, Duct tape. We just need the duct tape. That's all we need. Wheel. I think they're dead. I don't know if you heard them. We got four duct tape, 11 glue, uh, mechanical electrical parts. What else did I say we needed? Springs? We need springs? We know we need a light. Oh, leather. Uh, yeah. So let's do, uh, where's our cloth? Um, recipes, duct tape, go. And let's make, how much glue here? Um, Eighteen glue. Five minutes worth. Nineteen glue. Just do it. Let's just do it. Which is why I want to make sure we hang on to those bones. We're gonna need those bones for sure. Alright, so now we can start making. Which one takes longer? 137, 601. Let's make this one first. While we wait for this. Still need eight more. Uh, while we're doing that, what do we need for a chem station? Burning barrel, three cooking pots, short iron pipes, wood, beakers. Okay, there's our beakers. We got one cooking pot in there. How many do we have? We got three. Perfect. Okay. 
Okay. Um, pipes, pipes, there they are. And then the burning barrel is just forged iron and wood, I believe. Just need one forged iron. Uh, do we have any forged iron on us right now? No, we don't. You know, all that forged steel we got. I mean, it's kind of good that we got it, but we can't use it for anything but the motorbike. That's going to change everything around, though. Uh, so we're going to do recipes. What do I need for this? Oh, it's three forged iron. Oh. All right. No biggie. That we can make easy enough anyway. Um, let's get the burning barrel done. And then we can put together our... Yeah. So I'm going to have to leave the episode there, guys. Uh, so I will have the motorcycle with the exception... Because we, we do need an engine. We do have a, we do have a battery we can use. Um just use the crap battery because um, it doesn't really matter but we use the that battery and then um, yeah hopefully um, we'll have enough to do what I want to do now also too, I want to start making blueberry pies because we don't need meat for that we do need eggs but it's only one egg per pie because then we it's just animal fat uh, some blueberries um, cornmeal which we've got a bunch of corn right now so um, so we can make some blueberry pies and these are all growing too and I put all the blueberries we got out here so we got one two three four five blueberry plants so it's ten ten every time so that should give us plenty more pumpkins or I guess it's all our only pumpkins but I'll make some blueberry pies just so we have them Probably a little bit better than bacon and eggs. At least I'd be a bit, be a bit, a little bit more tasty, I would imagine. Another dog. Hear him out there? See ya. Yeah, we're doing well here. Can I actually make a crucible? I don't think I can. I gotta check. It's like I said, it's been so long since I've been recorded. Now. All right. Well, I'm going to end the episode there, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please, please feel free to subscribe, and you can drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.